What Manuel was saying, um, it will help identify whatever products you have at home as long as it has a barcode to be scanned. Um, let me show you, for example, this we got broccoli cheese soup. Broccoli cheese soup. With speech, the person will be easily be able to identify easily what they are, what, what they have in their hands. Now the second feature of our, of our project is concerned with uh, safety. People blind, you know, they want to be independent. That's the whole idea of our project, making them more independent. They're at home alone. They don't know what, what could happen if someone breaks into the house. So it's also connected to the house alarm. The house alarm, you can you, you arm it. Once it's armed and if, if it goes off, he would hear the alarm on his scanner and know that something stuff is going on. Let me demonstrate. Now the alarm is armed. For example, someone breaks into the house. You hear the alarm on the scanner. If they're away from home, just with a flip of the switch, they will have the loud alarm. Though they could be aware that something happening in the house. Uh, Daniel is going to explain us how the transmission works and how we came with the idea to link everything together. Okay. Um, our, the, our hardware uh, is, is real simple. Um, we, we start with a, with a Bluetooth scanner. Um, the scanner could, um, could be used as, as a handheld or in this case uh, together as one unit together with the receiver. Um, this is, was made out of fiberglass that we did for our project. Um, what this does is anything you scan, this will transmit it to the computer. The computer will look up the database the item on a database, once that database is found, it will send it to a program that's going to read the voice description, and uh, once it does that, it's going gonna, it's gonna to transmit it using the RF transmitter that we have here, and then right here we, have, we see the FM transmitter, once it's transmitted using the FM frequencies, it's going to send it over to the FM receiver. It could, uh, it could be used as a handheld device, or it could also be used uh, with the house uh, stereo system if they want to, since it transmits a radio frequency, which can be easily used. This is uh, the, the other option, that's just having the scanner on its own, and then instead of having the radio receiver, you could just turn on your house radio, tune it to 88.1 or similar station, and you can hear anywhere on the house. Um, in, the, in the alarm, we have a similar feature. We have, we have the alarm control box which is the big uh, ivory box that we see on the right. In that box is the household alarm. What our system does is that it links our system to the, to the existing household alarm, um, which, is the, which would be the black box next to it. And then in that black box, we have the transmitter that whenever the alarm goes off, it sends the radio frequency of the alarm or whatever signal or sound we, we would like to put and send it to the receiver that we have here. 